hello there welcome to my youtube channel future trail so in this video lecture i am going to show you how you can get cisco free collaboration lab so what you have to do in your browser you have to put this link i will give this link in my video description so once you give this link in browser it will ask for you to free sign up so let uh, this site open so now you can see you are getting the option for sign up for free so just click on that one and log in with your google account so let's wait so let me log in with my google account all right so i have logged in here so you have to just populate your basic information your first name last name display name and the email id and the company name so let's provide my company name in fee and then leave all other parameter as it is so and then send me the monthly donate news later via email i don't need that one then just click on that one by clicking on register and just click on register so once you register here so it is giving this all these option will come back and all this software will just click all this parameter and then click on the submit so once you submit here so here you are seeing explore technologies so on the explore technologies you are seeing networking data center cloud security iot collaboration analytics and automation and open source so whatever lab do you want just click on that and you will get the free lab so here i'm going to show you for the collaboration lab how you can set up a lab for the collaboration in the same way you can do for the other uh, technology as well so just click on the collaboration so once you click on the collaboration so it will give all the technology related to the collaboration so first one you can see here webex room kit plus ce so if you want to this lab so just click on the try it out then similarly cisco webex uh, collaboration cisco uc manager 12.5 cisco contact center express and another is the package contact center enterprise so if you want whatever you want to do just click there try it out and you will get uh, other uh, uh, suggestion how you can set up that one so here i'm going to show you for the collaboration in the same way you can do for the other as well so let's click for the collaboration 12.5 try it out i'm clicking here so once you click here try it out so it will open all the server details and the procedure to set up the lab so on the right hand side you can see the lab server details so they are providing here one cisco uh Susium publisher 12.5 and one subscriber and another they are giving i am presence then vlan all vlan details here so then one is the windows server active directory and another one is the cisco unity connection so in the left hand side you are seeing the user uh lab user guide so once you click here lab user guide so here all the detailed informations are there about this so just you have to go through this lab so but i will show you in this video how you can set up very quickly so just once when you whenever you are doing uh, this lab setup so just go through this uh, uh, lab user guide so at the bottom let me come to the bottom and here they have provided the server credentials so this is your CUCM publisher, subscriber, present server. So for everything, they have kept the same credentials. So username is the administrator and the password is the, this thing. So you can see all for all those things, uh, the credentials they have provided here. So what you have to do after doing all those things, just go back once again here and click on the reserve so once you click on the reserve if this lab is freely available i mean to say if this lab is not occupied by another user so they will reserve the lab they will send the notification to your register email id with all the credential detail how you can uh, how you can access this lab remotely from your laptop and the credential they will also provide you so let me click on the reserve so once i click on the reserve so here they are uh, giving you know six hours lab is available for the six hours so initially they will give you lab for the six hours and if you are let's say if you want to do more lab and you need more time so you can extend your time as per your requirement so now let's click on the reserve so it is reserving just checking in back end if this lab is available right now or not so if it is available so it will reserve the lab for me for the six hours and they will send all the credential detail to my email id so let's wait for a few moments and see if this is available and sending reserving the lab for me or not so you can see here uh they are showing me that uh, can't create sandbox due to the following conflicts one or more of the resources are already reserved so another uh, slot available time slot it is showing here uh, 29th march to 30 march between this time so during this time you can go 
and schedule your lab or you can try uh, before that one as well if that lab is available uh, they will schedule a lab for you so i will show you like, previously i have you know set up this lab for me for free so i will show you how it will come to your gmail account and uh, how you can set up that one so you can see here uh, previously it showed this lab uh, the uh, sandbox can't set up a lab for you because it is already reserved so let's say if that lab was available and uh, and you requested at that time and the Cisco sandbox uh, reserve the lab for you. So once they reserve the lab for you, they will send email like this. Your Cisco DevNet sandbox lab is ready. So hi, this is with your email ID. They will show you and uh, there is a good news. Uh, your collaboration 14.0 sandbox lab is ready. And now let's go. You connect it to your sandbox lab. So if you don't have any uh, connect install on your system, so you have to install. So what, what you have to do? after doing all those things you must have to install the cisco any connect vpn so just clicking on the first link uh, it will take you to download the cisco any connect vpn once you download the cisco any connect vpn so what you have to do here you you are seeing they have provided the details so they have provided the lab network address so you have to provide this address in your cisco any, any connect vpn so connect to this uh, server and the username and password they they will send you over the email so this is the username and the password so let me show how you can do that one i have already installed cisco any, any connect vpn in the past i have already accessed this free lab so how you have to set up this one so here you can see uh on the first you are seeing the vpn so here network uh, on the second you are seeing the network so this network is your uh, wi-fi network and the first one is the vpn so in this vpn you have to provide that details so what you have to do here um let me bring here all right so so this, just you have to copy this uh, this link lab network address just copy here and on the cisco and it connect vpn in the vpn since it is already there because in in past i have used that this one so that's why it is showing so let me so what you have to do just let, first time if you are doing this one so in the, the vpn you have to give this link and then click on the connect so once you click on the connect it will ask for the username and the password so you have to give that username and the password which is sent over the email for this link so let's say this username here they have given uh, this username and the password so just populate there you get that username and the password here so let's say if they have given some username random i'm just for example i'm giving random some username and the password they have given something and just click on the okay so once you connect here just click on okay so you will able to connect the uh, their lab network so once it connected so you have to go back here on the same dev net here so let me close this one because it is not showing for me because right now it is not available so once you connect here so here you you have to just click here and like option some option will come here like connect to this one so just after clicking this thing it will open in another browser and just you have to log in with the credential as i showed you already uh credential for this server you can give you can get here in the lab user guide so this lab you once you click in the lab user guide so on the bottom you will see the credential they have given for for all the servers and also you can access over the cli so in your laptop you must install the putty and over the putty just give this ip address and the ssh and the username and password same and with this you should be able to access the lab over the gui and over the cli as well and you can do whatever you want to do here so whenever you want let's say you have done lab two days after one after a few days you want to do lab once again and if that lab is once again available so just follow the same procedure uh, that link which I showed you in starting, go through that one, log in with your credential and reserve the lab after clicking here. And if that lab is available, so they will reserve the lab for you or else if this lab is not available, so they, they will give you the time slot when this lab is available. And before that one, you just schedule for your lab and you can enjoy your lab, whatever you want to do. So thanks for watching this, uh, my YouTube channel and video. And if you like, please don't forget to subscribe and share.